Skittly me, skittly do. It's a binge compilation from me to you. Okay, bye. Bro, do you mind if I like put my Minecraft bed next to yours? Like, bro, we we have to cuddle. <laughs> it was you, you want to? <laughs> it's, it's, it's a joke, bro. Right? Right? Oh, I'm sorry. There's a blackout. You can't go any farther until it's fixed. Then where the hell is that stale bag at going? Look at your wrist. See the bluish veins? The blood flowing through them contains hemoglobin, a protein that has four iron atoms incorporated into its structure. Iron is only naturally produced in one place. It can only be forged in the core of dying stars. Every time you look at your veins, remember that you are built from and kept alive by pieces of stardust. Catfish simultaneously look like they possess infinite knowledge of the universe and like they have just the me thee playing in their head nonstop. I now bound you two in holy macaroni. Oh my god, I need this ring. I need it right now in my life. Somebody, somebody proposed to me with this ring. Do it! Name one difference between birds and children. Children have eyebrows? Think again. Why does Snoop Dogg smile like he knows something you don't? He's been snooping around. Get out! A biblical-themed restaurant called the Garden of Eaton. One of the menu items is just a forbidden fruit. When I try to order it, they kick me out. Well, maybe you should have learned from the Bibbles, Nintendo Wii Boat. Did you ever think about that? You probably didn't, did you? In an effort to keep the cats from getting fur all over clean quilts, I'm going to try to apply the If there's a circle, a cat will sit in it maxim by hoping that if there is a different color box of blanket on the bed, they will lie on it. Update, it took less than a minute for them to find and lie on it. Mission success. <laughs> cats are dumb. So I was playing The Sims and it was all cool, right? Then I see something moving across the floor. Like, bruh, is that a freaking plate? Thinking about a dishwasher? What? Oh, the dirty plate wants to get clean. <laughs> a female dragonborn paladin with the noble background is the ultimate switch. She can be the knight, the princess, or the dragon as circumstances require. Now I'm just imagining a scenario where through a series of misunderstandings, she's hired to rescue herself from herself. Well, doesn't that just have sitcom writing all over it? Like, oh, yeah, I, I saw the princess. Hang on, let me just, uh, just, just go over here in the room for a second. Witches and cowboys are the same entity, but just separated at night and day. Uh, I'm sorry, could you kindly elaborate on that, please? Certainly. Big silly hats, dangerous aura, wand slash guns, midnight slash high noon, robe slash ponchos, stockings with boots slash chaps with boots, magic incantations slash yeehaw and slangs, bruise potion, bruise alcohol, ride brooms at night because horses are sleeping, ride horses at day because brooms are recharging, and... Can't swim. Also, moonshine is an alcoholic potion brewed by witches and cowboys. Moon to represent the witching hour, and shine for sunny high noons. My god. Somebody. Somebody write a story about this now! Oh my god, I love that kids that share too much information. Today a girl came in with her mom to order food and I told her I liked her dress and she said, Thanks, my mom stole it from Target! So precious. Oh, it's okay, Header. Oh, I know how anxiety feels. Today, I learned there are nerve endings that exist only to recognize a gentle stroking touch. Their activation decreases the heart rate and activates the smile muscle. Their optimal speed is 3 to 5 centimeters a second, which means we are genetically wired to cuddle and caress each other at predetermined velocities. So, um, anyone want to gently stroke me at 3 to 5 centimeters a second? just called my new boss by the wrong name in a meeting in front of everyone. What happened next? Awkward silence from everyone. Nobody corrected me. I eventually found out a few minutes later when someone called him by the right name. Call him by the wrong name again, but a different one than you just used. No, call him by the same wrong name again, but forcefully and with eye contact. You're the boss now. Introduce yourself by his name and call him by your own name. You're the boss now. My girlfriend is on a cruise, so while she's gone, I'm gonna cut the sleeves off all of my shirts. Why? She's pretty much 85% of my impulse control. Oh my god. How to summon a dad. Make a circle out of power tools. Screwdrivers and wrenches will do in a pinch. Place a pair of socks inside sandals in the middle of the summoning circle. Chant, I hungry, I'm dad, over and over. 
and touched the thermostat. Oh, people calling each other other romantic pet names sarcastically at first, but gradually developing into genuine heartfelt affection as the story and their relationship progresses is potentially lethal to the likes of lovey-dovey bitches such as me. Dude, the switch from a girl worth fighting for to coming upon a decimated village in Mulan is the most kick-in-the-teeth mood change in all of cinema. That scene shift did more for our generation's understanding of the horror of war in 10 seconds than Game of Thrones did in 8 seasons, and it did it without showing us a single dead body. Just a doll. That's it. I'm covered in blood for sexy reasons. Also, I just got stabbed. Don't suppose there's uh, anyone here willing to tenderly clean, stitch, and bandage my wounds while calling me an idiot in an exasperately fond tone of voice, is there? Extremists kidnapped an American journalist in Iraq. They're about to execute the poor soul named Clark Kent. Dude, imagine him trying to talk out of it just so they won't find out his identity when they're inevitably unable to kill him. And he succeeds and it turns into the story of this brave journalist who convinces captors to let him go. Or... Bruce sees this on one of the news and is just rubbing his temples and sighing before going to save him or asking someone else to do it. And this turns out that this scenario happens every often to the Man of Steel. <sighs> Alfred, I'm going to the Middle East before terrorists find out Clark is Superman. Is it Tuesday already, Master Bruce? And the Robins are taking bets on who succeeds first. Clark talking his way out, Batman rescuing Clark, or Superman just appearing and cock blocking the rescue. Introducing pre-cracked egg. Finally! Why is his neck like that? I enjoy. Bones healing stronger after they break is like when your mom does a double knot when tying your shoes. Your body's like, there, because you're a clumsy frick. Conclusion, break all your bones here twice as strong. That's, that's just my hero academia, isn't it? Gonna go stand in a creek, do you guys need anything? Yeah, I need you to find a leaf and gently set it in the water and watch solemnly as it floats away. Why have we all done this? The eyes of God. Rohodnike, Bulgaria. Here it is at night. Pretty sure the first picture is also at night, but super cool regardless. Oh no, he's here. Hey, what's up? He'll never get to drive the molten steel tractor. Why even live? Mmm, forbidden French onion soup. I don't understand the big obsession with pop punk. I can't hear you over how much I hate my town right now, thanks. Character says, I like bread, that one time. Fandom. Character has an obsession with bread. Bread is character's true love. Draws character as bread. Every meta joke in fan fiction is about bread. The character's room is wallpaper with bread. <clears throat> this is literally what happened with Travis and Tacos. Guys. Nintendo, we can't have alcohol in our child gambling games. Oh, but we have a solution. Vacation juice. Pour it into Isabel's mouth, you filthy animal. Dude, being a pessimist is great. I'm always either right or pleasantly surprised. Hey look, it's the optimistic look of pessimism. Oh god, the paradox is high in this one. Justin McElroy has said many powerful things, but honestly, no set of words in the English language conveys the same energy as, that's a funny trick to play on God. Your rearranging deck chairs on the Titanic, my friend, is a very close second. We can do whatever sins we want. There's no God here to observe us is very good too. The man who sleeps with a machete is a fool every night but one. Was well, also really good. Justin, you're a blessing on this world. How crazy is the English language that raccoon eating grapes could be literally just a raccoon eating grapes? Or grapes eating raccoons? My god. I don't like my language anymore. Oh, look at this absolute baby I found at work the other day. She absorbed the secrets of the orange and could not handle what she learned. Weakling. Fool that you are. She has gained the orange's understanding and therefore it's anger. I mean, yeah, it's a rather pale orange. It's probably mad. Y'all, there's a massive spider on my ceiling, and I don't know what to do about it. Did you try turning it off and then on? Oh, damn it. Is that how you beat Sister Location? Anyone else ever daydream for six hours straight, and then after you're just like, nah, let's scrap that, do that all again, but like slightly to the left. My god, who is reading my life? Brr, I stay hydrated. Or else. Side effects may include headache, nausea, suicide, cramps, spontaneous combustion, and anal rash. Meanwhile, the people in the medication ad are just having a great time. Such a great time. God damn it. I wish puberty took you to a customize your character screen. Do you realize how many people would be dragons? 
You say that like it's a bad thing. Sorry, mate, I can't talk right now. I'm being chased by a lit trail of gunpowder. Hey, what's that pouring out of your pocket? <gasps> oh my god. Is Mona Lisa single? Is Macklemore investing his money wisely? Is M just upside down W or am I going crazy? Is Masterpiece Theater real? Is my dad alive.com? Is making out with a piece of a meteor gay? What the f is wrong with the internet? A clown boy, half clown, half cowboy, says, yeah, this is it. This is the worst post I've ever seen. My own two eyes are cursed. Meanwhile, early video game development. Great, did you figure out what to put at the end? Yeah, we put this tough, nasty, mean, ugly monster that the player has to beat, and we made sure killing the monster feels as rewarding as possible. Cool, so what's it called? The boss. W why is it called that? Okay, so you guys know how incredibly sexy a go-go suit is, right? That cat suit's so freaking tight around her thighs and butt, obviously meant to be hot on purpose, you know, for a dozen movie. Just remember, this little kid designed that. Just remember that. Hmm. Diagnosis. Puberty. I mean, yeah, or just get understanding. Good taste, because Gogo was honestly the best character about that movie. <laughs> am I right or am I right? Okay, bye bye There's something morally wrong with Pikachu's mouth. This is a sign of demonic possession and somebody needs to help him. I'm gonna give him teeth to see if that helps. <sighs> nope, that didn't help at all. Why are they human teeth? If you had a room with absolutely nothing in it and the wall, ceilings, and floor were made of mirror, what would it look like in the mirrors? No. Holy crap, I asked my dad who's a physics teacher and he just looked at me, looked at the table, looked at me, tried not to smile, looked angry, and started to look up where you can buy big mirrors. Oh my god. I need results. Macbeth, upon whose Macbeth, took his final Macbeth. Ah, <sighs> reading this hurt. Macduff's life became Macduff when he saw through Macbiddy's Macbluff. You were there. And this is why you can't say the M word on stage. You guys ever think about how many eggs breakfast places like IHOP or Denny's go through? Like, dude, dude. <clears throat> I'm I'm sorry, I have the bubonic plague. I can't hang out tonight. Aw, oh, rats. <clears throat> okay, uh, cis male, tall and lanky, brown hair that I always hide under my hat. I don't leave anywhere without it. Italian, Japanese, kind of a nervous wreck, terrified of ghosts, and my favorite color is green. Oh my god, would date you? You sound adorable. Wahoo! You fell for the Luigi trap! Now I am your boyfriend! So my girlfriend is really country and I'm extremely punk rock. What do I do? Throw in her mosh pit and baptize her with the music of our people. Your mental illness is all in your head. Where did you think it was? My ass? Um, everybody knows mental illness is stored in the huevos. Mental illness is the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I hate this joke so much. Ah uh, yes, I love the FNAF humans. Phone guy, crying child, older brother, and... Killer Grape. Fahukukwads. Uh, did you mean Fahugogats? Oh, 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 my bad. Ooh, it's a Homestar 1-0 reference. So what if doorbells went dong ding instead of ding dong? Hey, don't say something like that. Any cookie is bite-sized if you try hard enough. <clears throat> um, any cookie is bite-sized if you try hard enough. I can't stop thinking about Batgirl's bathroom. The tub is literally in front of the door. Why is everything on one side of the bathroom? Is the rest of it all just empty? Okay, everyone in the notes is arguing that the tub is on wheels or that's not a door. But no one is mentioning that she keeps the raw plunger on the floor. Yo, and what about that rug that seems to be laid underneath the toilet? Good lord, this is like one of those how many mistakes can you spot in 60 seconds puzzles. Did, did this comic artist not know how a bathroom works? Hi, welcome to Olive Garden. Would you like olive or garden? Barn falling off into a swamp. Photo by Peter Stratmuin. Yeah, if years ago you told me that signing up for the site meant I would someday empathize with a barn, I would have laughed so hard. <laughs> God dang it, it's relatable. Reverse werewolf. Turn into the moon when you see a wolf. Um, <clears throat> you. I don't like you. So imagine James Potter getting wasted and making a bet with Sirius that he could totally transform into his animagus shape, no biggie, and it goes fine, but then he's too drunk to change back. 
and Muggles get confronted with this really drunk deer roaming the streets, pursued by a man who cannot stop laughing. These, these are the best. And these are the stories I wish Harry Potter told. Centaurs have six limbs and therefore are insects. Discuss. Oh, this. I don't like this. Why is there a pentagram on your floor? Okay, first of all, Mom, it's not a pentagram. And second, what are you doing in my apartment? Oh, sh I summoned my mom. My God, it's a parentagram. Wow, congrats on doing what Ed and Al could not. 